Hello everybody, welcome to Mr. GFX. Today we are going to speak about how to create and set up your uh, light to your uh, level just in a few minutes. So before we start, don't forget to subscribe for my channel and like for my video and let's get started. So uh, first of all, we need to uh, open our uh, level without any light okay so this is our uh, level okay without any uh, light and uh, now we can insert any directional light here okay to see our our level what we are going to do now we want to delete any light directional light or anything and i will insert hdr light okay from where window and uh, we can go to um, here HDR uh, light okay we will insert our uh, okay HDR and we can put it a little bit here okay under our ground okay here uh, we can scale it scale it here size we can put it uh, 100 uh, 1000 okay nice if you don't have HDR, you can go he from here, from uh, Edit, Plugin, and HDR, okay, and enable this one, and restart uh, Unreal and open it again. So this is a very, very important uh, step, okay. A skylight is not good for our uh, project, okay, I don't like to use it uh, all time, but now, uh, if you look here, we have HDR uh, ba backdrop from this area, we have a lot of um, HDR uh, map. You can choose one of them. Okay, this one for example. Uh, or just I like to choose anyone with uh, a sky like that. Okay, so this nice one. Uh, you can uh, increase and decrease the light from here as you like. Okay, from zero intensity. Okay, we can 0.1 increase it a little bit okay uh, 0 point, 0 point 0.5 0, 0 point 0.5 okay i think background is good now uh, okay so second step uh, for uh, now we can insert uh, any light uh, model okay light mesh for example we can insert this one to uh, insert our uh, light okay this one is emissive uh, light okay material if you don't know how to create emissive light it is so easy you can insert it uh, material and the material from here double click okay uh, double click after that we can uh, come from here press one and uh, oh, sorry press number three from keyboard and connect this one okay this is the uh, color of our emissive color and from here press one and connect this one to be emissive color okay so now we have or we can press m connect this one to this one okay and come here to emissive and to emissive okay sorry from here and now we have our uh, color we can increase it or decrease it apply now if you insert any any f any mesh like uh, like this one like this cube for example okay and come to this area and create instance okay this is duplicate for our uh one sorry we can come to this area and click uh, convert to parameter and this one to convert to parameter okay apply close okay now if you insert this one here double click and uh, come to this area now parameter this one okay we can uh, we can choose our uh, light for example now look this emissive color we can increase or decrease as you like okay now look uh, we can put it num one if you uh, scale this one here now look 
amazing we can use it here as you like but i don't uh, i don't want to use this one here so uh this texture okay this is the idea of our emissive color okay i use the this one to be emissive color this one okay now i uh, i'm going to insert this light to blueprint from here right click and uh, we can choose blueprint okay actor and uh, after that light 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 okay insert and uh, we can uh, choose this one import it here and uh, we can uh, insert light point light okay but we can put this one here here okay we can put it uh, here and uh, radius maybe we can okay attention radius compile and save okay so now if we insert our blueprint here in this area where is our uh, blueprint light okay so now if you look here this is our blueprint we can uh, put it in the right way here look here so intensity intensity we can put it here okay nice duplicate our light here here and here and we can put this one again here okay we can put this one look now we need to uh, arrange our light area okay so in this area in this area in this area okay so if you look here far away we can see our we can press g okay to uh, hide our uh, light so this is the first step uh, now uh, if you look if to uh, our uh, background here okay and uh, now we can add for example just I'm, I'm going to add increase this light a little bit intensity one okay to add water uh, color to this area uh, water material material here water 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 okay maybe we can add this one ah okay nice okay so this is uh, m water okay after that we can uh, hdr to be 0 0.1 okay look for our water now amazing okay so uh, after that we are going to add uh, a lot of uh, light here in this area uh, for example this, this one okay uh, rotate it a little bit here okay we can uh, edit our blueprint from here uh, edit our light and we can increase it a little bit our intensity of our light look, look. We can increase and decrease it a little bit. Okay, so this is a very important step. Now we add our uh, water to our scene. Water is make nice uh, reflect to uh, with light, uh, give me nice uh, impression. Okay, we can come to this area. Okay, amazing. So after that, maybe we can add another uh, light, for example, in this area. Okay, here. Uh, scale it a little bit. Okay. 
device in this area and uh, we can add uh, light point light here okay look amazing if you look from this area we can see our light is good but we want to increase it a little decrease it a little bit okay and okay now we can make group for this one group or you can create blueprint okay now do we can do the same here in this area what's this one here okay and here okay we can board this one now if you look here uh, press G look amazing amazing light uh, so now um, maybe we can uh, duplicate this one to add it in this area to light this area okay and we can come here again okay in this area in this area okay so now if you look here we have nice light but if you look for this details here in this area it doesn't appear for me uh, very well okay but we can add um, a spotlight here for example a spotlight and we can take this one okay G to uh, to see it okay we can come here to this area scale it okay now we can increase our value look uh, we can put this one radius increase radius okay and we can put this. now if you look here nice nice result okay look here nice and we can add the same here in this area we can put it here okay so now if you look here to this area and this area we can see our uh, details okay and uh, post process okay from here post okay post process volume and uh, we can add infinite from this area infinite make sure we have infinite to fold our uh, project after that we can uh, add uh, okay now we can play with our exposure okay exposure here uh, we can uh, increase it uh, or decrease it okay um, so this one to be one and the max value maybe we can uh, two we can make this one uh, one and three or zero and three okay to be uh, nice so now uh, good after that we can go to exposure local exposure it's very very important or we can play with shadow contrast okay look shadow we can play with this one after that we can uh, come here to this one uh, detail strength we can look for detail look here we can put it uh, 1.5 1.3 for example now and uh, we can uh, play with middle gray in this area look here we can decrease 
or increase at a, a little bit now good so this is yeah uh, we can play with uh, with those with uh, okay I think we can uh, decrease HDR light to be 0, 0 0.5 okay nice now after that we can add uh, fog light fog okay now if you look here we we add it but it doesn't work why because we need to fog uh, color we need to choose our fog color now if we can add any one from this okay look here our fog and we can fog intensity we can increase and decrease it a little bit look fog fall off and we can come here to this area to be foggy like that okay we can go to uh, post process again okay all time you can increase here and decrease here in this area uh, okay when you when we come to this area okay shadow contrast okay and okay this area and we can make it so after that oh, nice uh, here strengths and we can okay i can put here a fog light bloom and uh, uh, bloom i didn't play with bloom just in la uh, the final of our uh, project now but if you look here bloom intensity look here fog light a little bit okay so now if you come to this area what's this one here and this one here and we can duplicate it a little bit okay so now we can look for our project here we can Uh, if you look here to this area doesn't appear for us with details but we can come here and we can put it here we can to go, go to our food light and we can play with color look Now I think it okay. We can play with intensity. What it here? Uh, HDR light 0 0.01 0 0.1 okay so now we can come here so this is the easy way to uh, create light to your uh, level okay just in a few uh, minutes so if you like this video don't forget to subscribe for my channel and like for my video see you in the next video take care assalamu alaikum